Hello and welcome to Wyvern Gaming. I'm KG. And I'm Wyvern. And last time, what did we do last time? Uh, last time we met uh, Arane, um, a, uh, a plant girl. Um, and uh, we got the light orb. And uh, KG got lost. Yes, I got very <laughs> lost. Uh, but we did recruit one more person. Yep. And so. today... We're being harassed by Ashery. <laughs> Is it Ashery? Why is it you again? What? Are you tired of seeing me already? Of course I'm not. So now you're in town too, Ashery. Did you finish what you needed to do? Um, it's not over yet. The situation at the beach is tricky. The beach again? What is this beach thing you keep mentioning? I told you, it's a secret. You can ask all you want, but I'm not telling. If it's such a big secret, then why do you keep talking about it? You're right. But I only brought it up because I wanted to ask you for a favour. A favour? What is it? Rita and I have been working on something, but there's been a situation. She's at the beach right, taking care of it right now, so I could come and find you. I'd like to get I'd like you to get a crystal from the spectral cave. I can't leave Rita out there by herself for too long, so I might need to hurry back soon. A crystal? What does it do? The rainbow crystal contains powerful magic. A little accident today needs a little extra mana. I plan to look for it myself once the situation is stabilised. Are you willing to help us? The Spectral Cave? Isn't that where I met Ribbon? Ribbon saw pretty crystals there too, but do they contain magic? Ribbon doesn't remember sensing anything. Well, roughly once a month, there's one crystal that's completely filled with mana. You have to go pretty deep to find it. This seems very urgent. We'll take care of it. Oh, it's rare for everyone to get too serious. Let's get searching! Thank you so much. This takes a weight off my shoulders. Oh yeah, I hear that Kotri and Hadora are also searching for the Raven Crystal. Don't let them get to it first. That's all. I need to head back now. Later. We got some money, so uh, let's stop by the shop before we get on with Ashery's little quest. Um, don't believe. Oh yeah, I need to. Uh, need to upgrade that. Definitely like invincibility time after getting hit. These ones. Probably spend the rest on. Uh, yeah, I'll get help as well. What do everything except pack points? <laughs> See if we can find that crystal. Yep. But first, we must find the correct warp destination. Which is Spectral Cave. Those fake bunnies get everywhere. And look at who it, who it is. The crystals here are really pretty. Thanks for bringing me here. 
Yeah, aren't they beautiful? These earrings are made of crystal too, but they were made a long time ago. There really are a ton of crystals under the forest. Crystals have limited ma mana, but hopefully this will be powerful enough for the style. Hey, can you teach me how to dance? I really loved your performances. Sure, but I'm not that good. I might not be a good teacher. No, you're really good. I want to dance as elegantly as you do, so I can feel like a real princess. Hmm. I think I can get you started on the basics. We have the crystals now, so let's get back to town and get started. Really? Great. Thank you, Kotri. They've become such great friends. But Ribbon would like to know why they're dressed like that down here. <laughs> I don't think you have the right to question their clothes. Mm. Look, they're dressed quite similarly. Maybe they like the same things. They look like they're on their way back. Ribbon hopes the rabbit crystal is still there. Don't think Erin is one to talk when it comes to uh, clothes. No, uh, quite definitely, and uh, I do believe we had that pretty much that exact same conversation near the start of the game between Erin and Ribbon. Yeah. Now then, let's just check. I do not have the attack trade on. Good. Yep. Here we go. There are a lot of crystals, all right, but none of them are magical. The most magical place must be in the deepest areas. Ribbon hopes we can find something of value. Ribbon, don't you think this cave layout looks like something waiting to happen? You're right, Arana, but don't talk about it. Ribbon doesn't even want to think about it. <laughs> Too late. Well, it happened. Is this my fault? Kind of, maybe? But if we can put a stop to this thing, we might find the magical rainbow crystal. I mean, I'd say that looks yeah. like seven crystals yeah. of that a rainbow. That looks like a pretty uh, magical rainbow crystal to me. I will switch to red beam. And, uh... There's one interesting thing to say about this boss. Yeah. You see the stop gauge? Yeah. I believe this is about the only boss in the game where the entire boss fight is in stop mode. Hmm. I don't even know why they did that. I mean, I won't complain about having stop mode. There's plenty of places where I think they should have it and they don't. So it's nice having it here. Yeah. But, um, I'm just a little surprised that it's up 100% of the time. Yeah. Not sure if it's the only place in the entire game. I'm also not attacking that. Any particular reason? This boss, uh, as you can probably see, it's... Oh, hello. Ah, that was the wrong button. Yeah, I try to amulet when he does that. Yeah. Uh, this boss alternates between, like, all seven crystals coming at you and individual ones. And when it's just one, the color of the crystal determines which attack you get. There's two that are a lot harder than the others, and that's yellow and blue. What we had there earlier was orange, which is very easy to use with like yellow. So I tend to try and, um, when I'm fighting the individual ones, I only attack yellow or blue. Oh, and that would be yellow. Uh, sorry, yellow and purple, not yellow and blue. Yeah. Uh, yellow and pu purple are the most annoying two, so I attack those two because the crystals oh. die individually, and once they die, once they've died. They don't attack you, they don't do your their individual attacks anymore. But I don't think we're gonna have much problem in this fight anyway, because it's going way faster than it usually ever does for me. <laughs> and I don't even know why.
Also, once it, once you start killing some of the crystals, each one you kill, oh, that is purple. That needs to die. Oh, it's dead. Each one you kill actually heals you. Right. So once you actually get them down to low health and start killing them, it gets a lot easier in terms of survivability. Okay, that attack gets a bit nastier as the fight goes on, I think. Because they're spinning around rather faster with less of them. And I keep just walking into them. And I missed. Yay! There we go. What did that destroy? It stopped. So this is the crystal Ashri was talking about. It should be. Such an active crystal must be incredibly magical. Hmm. If only Ashri were here. We'll probably just have to take it to her. Mm. Didn't we destroy it though? Yeah. Oh well. Hey, tough Either skin. Way, our reward, tough skin. Yep. Which, um. What is this? Toxic curse and burn effects. Hmm. Well, I don't have the ability to equip it right now, and, yep. uh. It, it seems rather specific. I can't think of a place off the top of my head where I would actively want that, although it wouldn't do any harm. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Oh, hi, Ashri. Oh, it's you two. Have you started looking for the rainbow crystal? Miss Ashri, why are you here? Have you solved your problem? I said I'd come over when things cool down, right? The situation is under control for now, but the crystal is still a priority. Well, we're a step ahead of you. Look, we found it. No way, already? Great, that means that island won't be seen again. What do you mean, Miss Ashery? Haha, <laughs> nothing, nothing. Actually, I'm not sure myself. Thank you, I'll take this back now. Solving your problems feels good. You can count me in on the stell too. I'll get back to town to help out as soon as possible. This is great, Arina. Ashery can help us now. I must thank Ashery as well. See you later then. <laughs> Off she goes. Off she goes back to town. Yep. And I believe if we look in town, yep. she is indeed in there, right in the middle. Number eleven. So that's how you get Ashri to join. Although she is now technically extra to the ones that we needed for the stuff, because yeah. we only needed ten. Hmm. And. uh... We are now in this volcanic area, which I believe we showed you before, and uh, I ran away from. <laughs> it's not that bad. Spikes. There's also no other way to get out. Once you fought the rainbow crystal, you have to come through here. Right. Um, we did, however, get the item down there earlier. Uh, try and not miss all these today. <laughs> you know what? I'll take that. <laughs> Good enough for me. Yep. There's that what point? Oh, there you go. Where I uh, very quickly ran away the previous time, but uh, yep. you know what? We can go all the way to the other end. <laughs> There's not actually all that much here, but we yeah. may as well get it on that. We have a yep. we have a save point. Yep. And now we have one heck of a destructive terrain group. <laughs> Oh, 
flowers. Flowers and bombs. The deadliest flowers. <laughs> Probably not the deadliest bombs though. There are far, far deadlier bombs out there. Yeah. But these flowers are pretty deadly for being flowers. They they look they look more like um uh uh, uh cherry cherry bombs. Which is something I've only like seen Ooh, in the Health up maximum, health increased. Uh, which is something I've only ever seen in sort of like, sort of like stuff. <laughs> I'm not quite sure if that's supposed to be an exit or what, but it's. Yeah. Uh, Did look suspicious. Yeah, it looks down sus. Yeah. yeah, I've only ever seen like cherry bombs in stuff mentioned in in the states. So I don't think I've ever seen it in anything. Uh, uh, set outside of the the United States. Uh, All right, let's make our way up here. Mm. Uh, we have mushroom, mushroom. The mushrooms. Yep. <laughs> and hey, we're back in a familiar tune. Yep. Can we go this way? Come out. At the beach. At the beach. Beach. Specifically the west side of the beach, which yeah. means the fastest way to go is actually this way, I believe. Hmm. Yeah, not falling for that today. Yep. Oh. I guess I fell for that one. Not that it matters. <laughs> These enemies are super weak now. Yeah. After just coming out of a freaking volcano. It's always interesting seeing the difference between mm. uh, certainly later game enemies and early game ones when you haven't seen them for a while. Yeah. Reminds me of um, uh, that one scene from um, uh, SAO. Uh, where he's like just not taking any damage uh, from the player killers. So, uh, well, Does he ever player take any damage? Uh, <laughs> I. He's kind of OP, right? Yeah. Either way, we have successfully made it back to yep. town. Yep. So I'm just gonna head right on here to the save point and. Somehow we got a whole bunch of EN again, so I guess I'll spend that, may as well. <laughs> yeah. Go, uh... Go buy a few more potions and jazz. <laughs> well, it is only going to be potions. We haven't exactly picked any items. Yeah. So, uh... Why not? Yep. And... I can get some more health. In fact, I'm going to go all into health. For a reason. <laughs> uh... And... Sure, more SP sounds good. 107 yen. Nice. But I think that is about where we'll call it for this episode. Yeah. Um, we have gotten a little distracted from our quest of visiting the Stell once again. Yep. No thanks to Ashery and her rainbow crystal. <laughs> but we've got that taken care of now, and we've got the volcano on map. So next time, yep. we are going to be heading to the Stell. Yep, see you then. Thank you all for watching, yep. and we will see you next time. Bye. Bye for now. <laughs>